The Pike Township Fire Department getting some new equipment thanks to a local company. That equipment could uh, one day save a member of your family. And we were there for the giveaway. We already have a way to rescue our human fire victims, but we needed a way to rescue the pets. Uh, much like anyone else, we know that a pet is a huge part of the family. And now the Pike Township Fire Department has it. In the past, if we've not had the equipment, then unfortunately we've just kind of done our best. But um, you know, going forward, I'm glad that we will have the equipment so we can uh, do the best job we can. The department receiving 12 pet oxygen mask kits today, all thanks to Invisible Fence of Central Indiana. We wanted to do this donation today because in many cases, um, a pet isn't just uh, a pet for a lot of uh, families. It's part of the family. Invisible Fence has donated nearly 19,000 pet oxygen masks to fire stations all over the United States and Canada. If they bring the pet out and they do see a need for um, oxygen, they in most cases, cases would use a, a mask that is designed to fit a human or a person. Um, with the pet oxygen masks, um, these are a proper fit. They properly fit right over their snout. An estimated 40,000 to 150,000 pets die in fires each year. The cause of death, in most cases, smoke inhalation. I can remember spending some time at a preschool and um, a young boy told me that unfortunately he had lost his pet in a fire and I told him, you know, buddy, we're working on ways to make sure that didn't happen again. So uh, this is really heartwarming and I'll be excited to go back to that preschool and, you know, let this little guy know that, you know, this won't happen again. All right, listen to this. Invisible, Invisible Fence says more than 180 pets have been saved because of their donations so far. Wonderful.